and welcome back to another video! Hello and welcome back to another video! So, um, this is the most compact 2x2 piston door that I have seen in Minecraft and I haven't seen anyone else do this. Uh, well, I haven't seen this uh, design before, I was literally just like, in Minecraft, just like, you know what, I might, I might as well go back to like, you know, some piston doors and um, see, um, you know, um, if I can make them any more compact. This isn't the most compact design, this is just, just like, um, one design I was thinking about trying to make it more compact, and it is just like, yeah, that, that was somewhat of a success, a success I guess, it's, it's a relatively compact. Uh, design, but no, the design, uh, the most compact design I will make in a minute, but it is integrated into this building. And that's it. That, that is the door right there. Works perfectly. I made this little house around it because um, because the pistons are here behind this wall. If I smash it quickly, so you, so unless you want uh, ugly pistons being seen. You'll have want to have this wall. You could like have something up here to decorate it. I just quickly threw this up. Um, so I built that bit there, and I put those bits there, and I decided, decided to put gla glass there. Also, you could put glass there, but I prefer not to because um, that's where the ceiling is. And then what I did over here on each on each side, as you can see, I just um, copied it. So three there and the, the, there with windows and then three here and here and then two in the center so this is basically replicating that side basically um but not totally and you know you can add more layers onto this or whatever this is just like um, an example building um to uh, um demonstrate how this works and yes i know there's a there's a couple like chunks there and there that i'm missing i don't know why that's happened anyway so um for an example building i think i actually Made of a quite nice one. Anyway, so you go in, you know, plenty of room for like all all your chests. Like this, this is like enough chest to uh, do your file. And uh, um, if you want more storage space, replace the chest with barrels and put some barrels up there, uh, because barrels, unlike chests, can open no matter what you put on top of them. So yeah, uh, that's why I usually use barrels. But I decided to do chests because I wanted to do this thing where. Um, you have the double chest on the inside and the single chest on the outside on this side and on this side You have the single chest on the inside and the double chest on the outside. I just want that's the only reason why I use the chest over the barrels this time You have a little enchantment room here, which actually does go up to level 30 um, I check so if I get the sword here And I shove it in here Yeah, level 30 Let's see what I get if I do, do level 30 Literally just fire that that is the worst level 13 shaman I've ever seen. I, I, I'm a, let, let's just get in another sword. Oh wait, this uh, this one's already enchanted. Am I 100? I'm not 100 percent sure. I, I'll double check, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I was level 30. Yeah, level 30. I'm well, breaking free, but have they nerfed the enchantment table or something? Seriously. Anyway, um, and over here we just have like furnaces, blast furnaces, and smokers. So like you can have the extra speed of the blast furnace and the smokers, and the regular furnaces to smell wherever they can't. And just a wall of like crafting stuff and a barrel, uh, not barrel, a um, composter. So you have like the cut cartography table, loom, uh, stone cutter. Oh, it's all one word apparently. I thought it was two words. Anyway. You have uh, um, the anvil, you have the brewing stand, you have uh, um, the grindstone, you have smithing and fletching table, which you'll need in an update, um, and a cra normal crafting table, and a, a um, and a cauldron if you want to use that, to die, like dye leather ammo or something, and a day, um, campfire, just in case you run out of fuel. So yeah. The, um, I don't know why I'm doing a base tour, but yeah, it's compact. It's so you don't see any of the pistons. 
Like, you could replace it. I could replace it. Replace those iron blocks, but yeah, super fast. So, um, what you'll need to build these compact piston doors is four sticky pistons, four of a bitch, uh, um, on any pressure plates, wooden pressure plates preferably, um, and like something to make the door out of. So I prefer bitch. Two redstone torches and some redstone dust. And that's literally everything. Oh, apparently Elvis was in my game, I didn't realise. So, to build this. So, we're going to have those two there. So, bitch. Skip two. Pistons there. Bitch planks there. So, uh, let me just break out this area quickly. So, how this is going to work is, um, over here, we're going to have a, a redstone torch with a block on top of it on both sides. There we go. So now they are powered. Now, um, obviously you're going to want your uh, pressure plates and the pressure plates on the both sides here. So, we're going to hook the ears up with some redstone, so just like bop, 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 bop. And then, well that's even the one, one there. And then, we're literally just going to run this oh, redstone dust into there. And there we go. That is as compact as you can make it, and then obviously you can just like fill in this floor and you'll probably want to hide away the pistons but yeah this is probably the most compact you can get it possible in minecraft bedrock i cannot think of any other way you could make this any more any less compact and it is super simple so anyone can build this and the, the and it is quite quick like Next to no to no delay. Like, yeah. No delay, you just like, bam, open. So yeah, super quick. Resource efficient. And you can pretty much fit this into almost any build. And I will say that um, with smaller houses, like say the size of a villager house, um... You'd probably have a little bit more trouble fitting it in, um, but yeah, most houses shouldn't have a problem uh, with this if you have a 2x2 two two door. And now obviously if you have a 1x2 door, it's even more compact with just um, that, that, that. And now I haven't really done any testing with um, one by two. Um, yeah, that there. One. Yeah, I haven't really done any testing with one by two piston doors. See if I can get make it any more compact. But yeah, you can make this into a one by two piston door as well. Makes exactly the same. I mean, if you want them opening from different sides, then that's gonna. Um, that's, that would actually come. Hmm. That might actually be a thing. Yeah, I might do some, uh, you know, stuff with one by two piston doors because um, a lot of people do like one by twos just because it's easier to get everything symmetri symmetrical. Um, but yeah, it also works in one by twos. So yeah, if you, I don't, I, I've no, right. I'm not gonna act like. The, what I've done here is, you know, galaxy mind, genius, best thing ever. Um, it's definitely not, and and i probably not the first person to have um, done this, but I've not seen this design in my time of playing Minecraft, and I've been playing since about 2012-ish. 
and this is the first time I've even had the idea of doing it, setting it up this way, so maybe this was just something that got, oh, and, you know, something that got overlooked until I, you know, because people was, oh, yeah, two by two piston doors, they're fine enough, and then it was, and then it, and it's probably just like me being lucky, just like going back and just thinking, could we make this better? Um, and then maybe it's just like me being lucky and just like figuring out, you know, just like, wait a minute, we can make it better this way. Um, because this is probably the easiest, the, the most compact. Like, if you know a more compact um, way, I, I would, you know, post it down in the comment section below and you know, video about it, and then I'll look at it, and then if it is more compact, then I will pin it and um, maybe make a video on it if it's like one of those lesser known. But I've never seen anybody do a piston door like this before. Again, I could. Did something explode? Anyway, uh, I, again, like I said, I want to emphasize this as much as possible. I could po very possibly not be the first person to discover this. But so far I know I am. I haven't really looked looked up any like suit like anything like this. So I so um, let me just go onto YouTube. Uh, I'll go onto YouTube quickly and uh, um, I'll edit me in um, if I do find this design somewhere. But uh, if not, then you know then this is we're gonna be this is gonna be where the episode ends. So yeah, bye bye. I'm back from 2012, so it's a little bit embarrassing. By um, Mr. Crayfish, was it? I think. Yeah, Mr. Crayfish, I put probably because of his videos. Um, that was similar, but it, you this uh, was using quasi connectivity again. So if that was uploaded in 2012, I don't know why I've never seen. I I think I even like remember hearing his name before, so I don't know why I haven't seen this particular setup before um but yeah it u makes use of quasi connectivity which is not in minecraft bedrock and it's not really that much more compact than um mine because it's basically one block more compact because you could technically do that and that where with mine you have to do it's like this so that is literally just like one more block compact but again uh, that uses quasi connectivity which is not in minecraft bedrock um actually i don't know if you would have been able to do that because i've I, would i have messed with the quasi connectivity ah, it's been a while since i've played java so i don't know um so i'll go and have another quick look but um yeah that was the first one suggested to me by youtube okay, whatever um so there's this other guy which isn't as big. Yeah, he does have 1.6 thousand subscribers. So I don't know why this video didn't get as many views. It only got 1,317 views with 16 likes and four dislikes. And uh, and it was published June 1st of 2019, which is actually rather interesting because that's only a couple months ago of doing this because it's currently. Um, August of 2019, August 18th to be exact. So, um, let, let's uh, that it is very similar, but not exactly the same, and is different in a couple of ways. So he has his redstone torch down there and block up there, um, and a redstone dot there. So. That does make up for the quasi connectivity, but this really isn't any more compact. And debatably, mine would actually probably be more resource efficient because you only use. Yeah, I think. Mm, I don't know, it's hard to tell. I think maybe it's just like the difference between one piece of redstone torch dust on each side. But there is that, there is um, that one. So if you want to go check out his video, there, there is no audio in it, so that's probably why he didn't do as well or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, that was by 
N I K L A X space capital X. Nikalax six? I don't know. Um So that what that one was quite similar, so clearly not the first person to have this thought or similar thought, but for the most but I am looking on here right now and it, uh, um, most of these are like 3x2, two, 2x2, two 2x1, two two piston doors, actually. Could you... No, because I know I would. Turn it off now. Um, unless I put a door rest. Oh yeah, and then you can upgrade these into 2x3 if you want to, I guess. That's cool. Anyway. Um But yeah, I've I'm actually not really seen this design anywhere. Um other than uh the aforementioned Mr. Crayfish and that end guy, which firstly Mr. Crayfish is, was a long time ago and only works on Java, but you know if you know anything about Redstone you could probably um adapt it to bedrock. Um, but yeah, M most people when they're doing a 2x2 two two door, at least what YouTube is giving me mostly here, I li I like bearing in mind here I'm uh, uh, restricted to what YouTube is showing me, um, they're mostly, people mostly focus on 2x2 two two flush piston doors, which are harder to fit into a build. Um, but the reason why a lot of people are, you know, more interested in them is because um, they're good for like hidden bases and um, uh, all that fun stuff. So, again, I'm not the first person, that, like I said, like I, I didn't think I would have been, but I am not the first person to come up with this uh, um, rough idea, but I am the first person person to come up with this exact design so far I can tell. Nobody has, you know, done this exact layout, but and that's not too anyways, this is basically the most compact you can get a two by two and two by three. Three by two? I can't remember it. Does it go horizontal or uh lengthwise first? Two by two hold on, let me look on here. Because I think I saw one, yeah, one by two, so it goes horizontal and natural, so that's a like two by three, two by three, yeah, um, so, yeah, I think this is the most compact, you can make a two by two and two by three door, um, and I've not really seen this design, exact design anywhere else, because what this has over, um, the other guys' design is that, uh, the other two, Mr. Crayfish and that other guy designs that you can just like plop a block there and then have that piston power it. Um, so that is sort of limited to um, two by two where this is no, where this is limited to two by three. So a little bit of extra, po little extra point there. Um, so yeah, definitely think this is at least unique from what I've seen. I think pe I think this is just like something that I think Mr. Crayfish just made his and then people just like, like oh well we're not gonna ever make anything more compact so yeah. Not not that's not to like diss Mr. Crayfish or anything like he's a lot smarter than I am and he's been doing this a lot longer than I have. Um uh, so yeah. If you're not subscribed to him go subscribe to him and uh, definitely check out the other guys channel, what was it, Nikalaxx, you should check him out, um, just cause, um, he did uh, technically come up with a equally as compact design, but not as versatile as this design, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, bye bye.
If you liked this video, don't forget to hit that like button, comment down below what you thought of this video, and uh, if you want to see more of my stupid face, don't forget to hit that to subscribe and uh, the ring a ding uh, that uh, notification bell, otherwise YouTube won't uh, notify you of when I'm uploading videos for some unknown reason. And I'll see you guys in the next video.